in this tutorial we can see what is the use of uh, JSP expressions. So the JSP expressions can be used to the obtain the result of a function uh, method or any to create any object or to obtain the result of any variables. So we can see how to use uh, JSP expressions in a JSP application. So here in this uh, index.jsp application which was already created in the previous tutorials so we can go for the JSP expression the JSP expression basically starts with uh, less uh, than simple and uh, modulus and equal equals to so this is the JSP expression so JSP uh, here in this JSP expression what I will do is uh, I can go for date so that is called new date so this is the object that I was created or uh, that I need right now. So this will, uh, this we have to input this uh, date class, so which is in the util package. So to input this one, what I need to do is uh, here go for the less symbol and uh, modulus, and then add page. So and then go for the import statement. Import equals to within double code Java dot util dot star and then close the packet and use modulus here so this so this solves the import statement and this solves the date for the constructor here and then what I need to do is uh, just here I will uh, put some text for here that is uh, strong today is and after this I can go for slash strong so this is a simple uh, a tag over here and this is called uh, a JSP expression so expression is basically used to execute a particular task in the browser so here uh, I can uh, run this application Right. I got the result over here. Today is uh, Sunday, October 28, and 23, 5, 5, and 11. So, IST. So, here, just close this one. So, close this one. And here, what I need to do is uh, so, this is a uh, JSP expression. So, this is not actually the perfect uh, XML format of expression. If you want, you can use XML format. I kept, uh, expression in uh, JSP so that is supposed to be like this JSP expression so this is the XML format so close this uh, one and again so close this uh, JSP colon expression And in this uh, JSP expression, what I need to do is uh, I can go for the context path. The context path is I will print the context path of this web application. Request dot get context path. So this is uh, our request is also one of the implicit object which was automatically uh, created in uh, this JSP application and this uh, using the request object we are using the get context path. So this is the context path of the this uh, uh, web application. So here I will go with the, the strong tag and again so here I am closing that strong tag here and save this and uh, run this application all right this is what actually the output from that uh, previous uh, output from this program so here this is uh, today is and as well as the context of this slash jsp demo which is nothing but this one this is called the context path of this web application so here in this program what happens so this will uh, 
function as a JSP expression, but this is a pure XML format, and this is not this is better than this is this one. So we have to use this pure XML format, and this is very easy to use also. So this is how the JSP expressions are used in the JSP applications. Thanks for watching this tutorial. In the next tutorial, we can see JSP declarations.